Hello and welcome back to the MultiSurf 2 minute video series. Today let's build a 15 meter canoe body sailboat hull. And we'll start with this empty file. Uh, the only thing we have in it is a square which delineates a 2 meter box. Kind of sets our extents for the process. So we press X to look straight down the X view. Nothing in the selection set. Press S for quick splines. And we're going to start here with a five point B spline. One, you just click again to set the next point. Two, three, four, and double click to end for five. Let's make another one. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and double click to end. So now we want to move those to specific locations. Let's take the uh, curve which we intend to be our stern curve and we'll select that. We'll select its parents by clicking this button and then we'll remove the curve from the selection set. Now we have just our points in the selection set. We can do a multiple edit and we can change the X value from 0 to 15. And we can do the same here. We can select the curve, select its parents, remove the curve from the selection set, and we X value of 7.5. Enter. And zoom to fit. And now we can see we have our two curves. Okay, now for the bow curve, we press Y to look down the Y axis. Draw in our curve. One, two, three, four, and double click to end five. One curve already in our selection set. There's two and three makes a C-spline lofted surface. Accept the defaults and there's our hull. We can press F5 to see the uh, symmetry image and we can do things like um, maybe adjust this point here to be on the baseline so delta Z we can make that zero let's take these two points here and uh, change their delta Z to zero as well okay now we're starting to look like we have a nice stem and we're just gonna leave it at this point right now we have the basics for the canoe body and everything else is in the detail. So thank you very much and we got our two minute sailboat haul. Thank you.